Well, I'm Dr. Martin Glebe. I'm a urologic oncologist at the University of British Columbia in Vancouver. You talked today, Dr. Van Cleve, uh, Dr. Glebe, about the uh, issue of PC recurrence and some of the new trigger points, some of the things that should be looked at by patients and professionals. Talk a little bit about what uh, you share today with the audience. Well, I think like uh, most aspects of prostate cancer, the area of biochemical recurrence, which is a PSA recurrence after surgery, is represents a widely variable uh, disease, ranging from one of indolence and clinical insignificance to heralding the recurrence of a lethal cancer that will shorten longevity and quality uh, of life. Now, we talked about that. You mentioned things like PSA doubling time being one of the key factors of uh, observation. Yeah, I think what's important when a clinician uh, or when a patient has a PSA recurrence is for the clinician to help determine whether or not that disease poses a threat over the near or long term. And there are a number of tools available, clinical tools, that help to risk stratify. And these include uh, PSA doubling time, uh, they include Gleason grade in the pathologic specimen, as well as interval to biochemical recurrence. Individually, each of these are of importance, and multivariate analysis, similarly, they all, for, for the most part, help to stratify risk. There are now nomograms available and online that clinicians and patients can help use to help further uh, determine whether or not they've got a recurrence that can be watched for a while or one that may benefit from more aggressive multimodal type treatments to help uh, control the cancer. In the near future, there are also genomic signatures under development that add additional depth to the clinical variables in helping to identify more aggressive or less aggressive biologies to these cancers and identify, for example, which patients are at higher risk of developing metastasis and death, which again help to uh, make decisions regarding timing and intensity of subsequent treatments like hormone therapy and chemotherapy after, uh, after PSA recurrence.